Have you guys ever heard that expression that things that are meant to happen happen easily, fast, easily, with very little stress? And things not that- Not trying to find horses. Yeah, that's not easy. <laughs> and then things that aren't meant to be, meant to be, sometimes you struggle and worry and stress for a long period of time. I got a video for you guys. Something crazy is happening. I uh, just wanted to make this little video. Um, to, We're out and we have the puppers. To uh, chronicle what's happening. So uh, you guys know that ever since last year when we rescued our very first bird, um, I fell in love with him. He was a baby crow and I raised him from the time he was a tiny baby until he was able to um, go out on his own. And when he left, it was heartbreaking for me and I was just awful. And I have entertained ideas of getting a bird ever since that day. So for over a year now. And then fast forward this summer and I rescued another baby bird. And then when it was time for him to go out and um, leave me again, I just feel like I want a bird. Anyway, I've been looking and looking and narrowing down and researching and trying to figure out what kind of bird that I want. And I found one. I found the one that I think I want and it's just all been happening so fast and I think I'm gonna get him. I think I'm gonna get him. So before we can get a bird, we need to do some shopping. Um, so we're at the pet store and we're gonna go in and see what we can find for our new pet bird. Let's go. Because the dog's carrying case is just like. Aww. Macy's like, oh my god, there's cats. There are cats. Oh. <laughs> there's She's like, what the heck is Macy? Oh, she just hissed at Macy. The, the cat hissed at Macy. All right, so uh, the kind of bird that we Mom, are getting. Mom, come look. Come look. Come watch. Um, I'm probably not going to find anything Mom, at this pet watch. store. For the kittens. kittens. Like that little cream colored one is my favorite. Basically what I need is not here. So uh, basically what I'm looking for is a bird carrying case. I need a bird a carrying case. Um, this is all happening so fast. I'm feeling pressured and I'm feeling nervous and scared because I've been on the fence. Like birds are hard. They are hard. And I know that I've done wild birds recently and it's been joy, only fun and amazing. And none of it has been stressful, but oh, I'm nervous and we're going tonight. We're going tonight to see this bird. So I need something, at least a carrying case um, until I can figure out what I actually, I don't know even exactly what's going to come with him, but yeah, that's where we're going. We're headed there. Okay. We are on our way. I have a little carrying case. I went to the pet store to try and find a carrying case. Like they have really cute purses and bags and carrying cases for birds. And that's what I wanted. Um, I am, I am more nervous about getting bird than I was about buying a horse. But look at this. Birds cost almost as much as a horse, you guys. Right, you guys. We got a bird. Sam bought him for me for my birthday. I'm gonna introduce you guys when we get home. He's amazing though, like absolutely amazing. So, this is his food. I need to figure out what I can get him. <laughs> the girls are so excited. Like yeah, that, that is what we need. Toys hanging on. Let's it. see. That's perfect because he had a perch. You don't need. I don't think it, like that one. It shows without the lid. Right? Okay. You just put it somewhere. And yeah. It no, fine. Yeah, I do think he would love it. Ooh. Eyes. Meet Levi. Guys, meet Levi. He Levi is our new bird and he's a little uh, unsettled. His shoulders are uneven because Levi's on one. So like. Levi is our new bird. He is a Goffin's cockatoo, which is 
um, a smaller sized parrot. He is a parrot. I know some of you guys said don't get a parrot. He's really sweet. The reason that we got a Goffins is because we wanted a bird that was really affectionate, that wanted to be loved and held. So um, I know some of you guys are worried about our time commitment, but I think we've got it. We're homeschooled. And uh, we are really excited. We got him last night. Don't fall back. Don't fall back. I warn you. He's leaning back. Yeah, we got him last night, and he is definitely... Um, trying to settle in. He is hilarious. This Show is what him. we did on the car ride. We were just like, and he keeps pet him himself up. Um, yeah, he actually does love to be cuddled and kissed and he, held. And he loves your shoulder. It's, oops. He loves your shoulder. One of the things that I love about him is his crest. When he gets all nervous or upset, he will puff or his crest curious. up. Or curious. Or curious. Um, and then underneath. He's going on my back. <laughs> Underneath that hair um, is salmon colored and he oh is just boy. gorgeous. Uh, the girls are absolutely fighting over him. His owner went like this and he was hanging upside down. And he uh, move hanging. him up and down like this, Sophie. Um, yeah, so he has, he has been very lovingly cared for. Um, the reason that his owner had to rehome him He's is like, because she had some severe health issues it broke her heart she she cried and cried and i know he's feeling the stress of having been rehomed as well okay. um last night after the girls went to bed um sam sat down on the couch and he looked at sam and he must have reminded sam of his old owner the dad because he jumped on sam and started saying hello hello <laughs> Um, and then he started trying to nibble on Sam's beard and he was just he started dancing He was like dancing and so excited and he hasn't oh. been that way for us yet But anyway, we have a lot of work to do with him. We need to help him get used to us um, We're working on setting boundaries as well his old owner had him on a really strong on a really strong routine and we're trying to stick with his routine Yep, we're gonna. He's. He's like out. out we're gonna. He's, going out. he's like, who are they? <laughs> get it, buddy. Get it. He can just fly on top. Of yeah, he he's kind of like a little confused about the camera, <laughs> and he is confused about the little dogs. He. Oh, see, that's what he does when he's excited. Um, um, so when he first saw the little dog, he kind of went a little crazy and was like, "Who the heck do you think you are?" Gentle. He's kind of like Storm. He's a little like Storm. Thinks he's the boss of the world, but he's really well behaved. He's in excellent condition as you can see. Hopefully we'll be able to keep him in really good condition. Spend as much time as we can with him, which will be a lot. Nearby, I want to put all new toys in there so that it's a new environment and a very stimulating one for him. And he oh, is... That. Put the dog down. <laughs> Yeah, he, he did have two dogs at his past life, and he is not in love with our dogs right now. Put him down. And my, my um, priority right now is not getting him used to the dogs, but letting him settle in and get comfortable before. Oh, hi. Dance, 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 dance. <laughs> He does say words. He says hello, and he says I Hot. love you. I love you. Levi, say I love you. He says I don't love you yet. <laughs> Levi, say hello. Hi, Levi. Anyways, I'm excited for all of our adventures with our new parrot. Oh, I. <laughs> he actually drew that. Dance. Did you? Dance. Anyway, wish us luck, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Teach him to say, hello, guys, it's Levi. Good boy. We should teach him to say, hello, guys, it's Levi. <laughs> say, hello. Don't forget to make sure to hit that
that subscribe button down below.